to do to Sri Lanka what the Lehman Brothers did to the world. There will be um, a, a few slower ones, difficult to gauge those split finger slower ones. Let's take a look at this last hit. This is hit against the turn, but the full swing of the bat. That's why he's such a devastating player, he's such a dangerous player. Now what does Yusuf Patan do? Oh! That is tragedy from uh, Sri Lanka's perspective. That is the junction. <laughs> that bus stop where uh, people uh, ask for a ticket is called uh, No Ball Junction because it's, he lives in that area. Maybe after this game, it might be called White Ball Junction. Well, he's got to turn it around. 14 wide, at least 14 runs, maybe 10 extra deliveries. But he needs to take a wicket now. There's that slower one. Are they going to try and convert it into two? Really, nothing in it. But at least they've got the single. Now, just take a look at the shots played by Yusuf. Magnificent. Well, that's over extra cover. This one straight for a six, and this one you would say this is a wild hike, but it isn't. It's a calculated shot. So the asking rate down to 9.14. India still in it. Batting pair left. There is Zahir and Ishan to follow. It's not going to be easy. It's not going to be easy. I'm sure they can't be thinking about that, these two. They've got to be quite uncomplicated. They've got to be focused on the job at hand. And, of course, Yusuf has got to play his game. They might need the odd luck in a shot played. He's got that through. He's going to come back for the second. And they can feel. It'll be interesting to see what uh, bowling changes are affected by uh, Dilshan for the next over. Bandara has bowled well, but he went for uh, plenty in the previous over. Fine leg has just come into the circle. We're going for the single. If that hits, that can be close this partnership is broken then uh, it's all over for India and uh, Nasik Malinga he can mix it up very very well we just saw that yes the opposition that's what it's all about it's a good start by Malinga another slowish delivery and he's got it away Right to the fence, but two runs. They said 26 to get from 16. Probably got an inside edge onto that. No appeal from the bowler. It's quite clearly because there's no signal from the umpire that there was a bit of an inside edge. Now, what is Malinga going to bowl to Yusuf Patan? You know that Yusuf Patan is looking for the big hit. Only three runs of the first three deliveries. And the asking rate is 10 runs and over. Yusuf Patan is setting himself up, looking at where the field is, where the fielders are on the boundary. Not that it makes a difference when he hits it well. Couldn't quite get it away. That was the one in the block hole. Clever ball run so far. Got to try and get a boundary from somewhere. He's gone over the top and I think he's got his boundary. Has it gone all the way? One bounce and out.
That is a magnificent shot over extra cover. Brings up the 150 of the innings and the boundary for the over. As if his uh, brother can hit it over extra cover. Yusuf Pata, uh, Irfan Patan shows that he can do it too. Well, that should take some of the pressure off these two brothers. They're complementing each other perfectly. One delivery to eight runs in the bag already. 20 to get from 13. That's the equation. A slower delivery and that's been hammered to mid-wicket. He's going to come back for the second. 10 off the over. 154 for 7. But that's the name of the game. You've got to vary it. You've got to outthink the batsman. Mid-wicket is an area that I'm sure he'll target. Fine leg is up. That's the one he's targeted. And that is a flat hit for six. The short ball. Why didn't he try the block hole? This is a terrific shot. Short. And he's given all the time in the world for Irfan Patan to pick his spot. Well, I did say they worked out Yusuf Patan's lengths, but they still haven't been tried, haven't worked out Irfan as yet. That's gone on the offside. They're going to come back for the second. Malinga does the cleanup job, but suddenly India with their noses ahead now. Well, nine from eight balls required, so that's a lot easier than it was at the start of the over before that six by uh, Irfan Pathan. What a partnership. When these two came together, they put on 48 from 21 balls. That's how difficult it was. There's nobody after them, really. Of course, Zaheer can clout a few. So can Ishant. He's gone inside out this time. Irfan has got another boundary. One and over. Tremendous batting by the two brothers, particularly Irfan now. And maybe the crowd knows a little bit more than the uh, Sri Lankan captain does. Because uh, they were saying as soon as the ball was given to Dilhara Fernando, they were saying no, no, no. And maybe they know why. Five to get from seven. Dilhara really bowling the ideal length for Irfan to work him around. And really aren't they pumped up? It must be... In must be a terrific adrenaline rush for the two at the moment. 13 from the over, dot ball to end it, 167. All their cards, so it's up to the Indians. Well, I think they played the wrong card. There's no question that they should have had Sanat Jai Surya. Three overs, one wicket for 10 runs. He had one over left. And being a slow bowler, being the experienced bowler that he is, and also getting turn. We saw the turn he was getting. It would not have been easy batting that 17 runs from that Bandara over that changed it. That put paid to all ambitions uh, of the spinners. That's probably what stopped Dilshan from using the fourth over of Sanajay Surya. Well, they've got that single. That's all they need. They're on course, India. Miscued shot. Yes, they need to be there because they'll get a wicket with that. But in the circle, they need to look at stopping the singles. They've got to force uh, these batsmen to try and find a boundary. How does Irfan react to this? Oh, brilliant! Magnificent, in fact. That's all the way. What a way to win this game. India prevail. Not for nothing have they underscored their world champion status. This is a miraculous win. The crowd is stunned, but I'm sure they've got their money's worth. And look at the Pathan brothers. The slot. And as soon as he hit it, he knew it had gone. So making up for that missed opportunity, Irfan Pathan. He might have dropped that catch, but he's made up a hundred times with that innings and look at that Indian dressing room absolutely over the moon well this is a shot in the arm any team would